Given Wimbledon clearly have a problem with their ticket sales, looking at all the empty seats, I've come up with some natty solutions for getting a few more people in. There's five of them. Number one, Nick Kyrgios. More of him, please. At a time when everyone is bending it over, taking it up the arse, wanting more rules, endless rules, don't do this, don't do that. He is the rebel we all need. The minute the BBC commentators start clutching at their pearls, I want us to cut to camera two. And Nick Kyrgios being teabagged by some morbidly obese lineswoman they were forced to employ, squeezed into Ralph Lauren with that gunt overhanging that she has. Number two, we need more tool. Why the women have to turn up dressed like some old Tampax that isn't one, I don't know, or even worse in shorts. If I was ever good enough to be able to play tennis at that level, I would totally turn up full ballerina, maybe even some little ribbons up round the shin. Just think about it, ladies. Try and be a bit more balletic. More tool would definitely help with that. We need more perspective for Serena Williams. We need to put some little people next to Serena so you can really get a sense of just what a unit she is. I love her. She reminds me of like when you get a cruise ship that pulls into like Venice or off the coast of Florida and you go, holy shit. Look at the size of that thing. We need more of that and a few little people next to Serena, like scientists use a 5p next to a bug. We need to get some perspective to truly enjoy it. And we need more Federer in a suit. Who gives a shit about the tennis? Him in a suit with his little naked ankles and those tennis pumps, <laughs> please. Either that or just Federer doing Bond all over the place. And finally, Novak Djokovic in a pure blood t-shirt because he is, he might not be able to go to the US Open because of it and we love him even more because of it too. See, five simple solutions from me, Katie Hopkins. Piece of piss.